Tonight, live pictures from Pad 39A at the Kennedy Space Center as Crew 6 gets ready to head to the International Space Station. SpaceX and NASA are in the last two and a half hours of the countdown ticking towards 1.45 a.m. liftoff. Good evening to you. I'm Eric Von Anken. Glad you're with us tonight. Crew 6 is commanded and piloted by two NASA astronauts, but also includes a Russian cosmonaut and an astronaut from the UAE who is set to make history. The Emirati is going to be the first from his country to stay long term at the space station. We've got live team coverage for you across the Space Coast tonight, starting with News 6's James Sparvero, who's live at the Kennedy Space Center. And James, the four astronauts just got to the launch pad in new black Teslas instead of the old white ones that we've seen in the past. Only the best from SpaceX, Eric. I guess the 2020 models weren't new enough anymore, so maybe 2023, to the best of our knowledge, those black Teslas, we watched them go by here at the Kennedy Space, Kennedy Space Center press site about 30 minutes ago. And now the astronauts, as you mentioned, Crew-6, the sixth full-length mission to the International Space Station for SpaceX under NASA's commercial crew program. They're at launch pad 39A right now, and they are taking those final steps just outside the Crew Dragon Endeavor no, capsule before they ingress into the capsule, and the process goes from there. After that, they will launch at 1.45 in the morning, and we want to take you back just moments ago when they stepped out of their astronaut crew quarters and they got into those Teslas saying their final moments goodbye to their families. Watch. And here they come, Crew 6, taking their first steps outside before their journey to space. And now they'll stand in front of their family and loved ones and have some exchange. Such a precious, heartwarming moment to watch every time a crew goes to the International Space Station. Again, this being the sixth full-length duration mission, a six-month science mission, Eric, over 200 science experiments for this crew. We're leaving Crew 5, which launched here from Kennedy Space Center back in the fall, and they've got a very busy schedule once they get to the International Space Station, about 24 hours after launch, sometime on Tuesday morning. They will rendezvous with Crew 5, of course, relieve them, and then Crew 5 comes home about a week later. They will meet the Starliner crew, hopefully, from Boeing. Boeing finally getting off the ground here with astronauts, possibly from Kennedy Space Center sometime in April. And then later the private crew of Axiom 2. We heard tonight that May might be the time frame for that mission. We'll join you again right up as we count down to this launch, Eric. 1.45 in the morning, another overnight mission here at Kennedy Space Center. Should be a great launch, James. The astronauts aren't supposed to actually touch their family members, but I think I saw some fist bumps. We'll talk to you again very soon.